Okay, today we're going to be changing the speed sensor on this because it's going slow. And I'm also going to replace the magnet that's on the motor with a high speed magnet. It's supposed to give up to like 4 miles per hour faster. So that's what we're going to try and see how it works out. Okay, the first thing is we have the key off and we're going to put the motor in the tow position. Okay. This way there's no power going to the sensor. Okay, we removed the four three-quarter inch lug nuts. There was a hubcap on this model here. It just pops off with a screwdriver. And this jack I'm using, if you don't have a jack that has an automatic safety, this one here locks. So if it drops down, it will catch. And it's safe. It's like a jack stand and jack all in one. Then put something underneath blocks or whatever. So in case you work on it, on it and something happens it don't come down on you okay and then if you look underneath we have access to the motor okay and we're going to start working on it okay this is really simple what you have to do is depress this button over here and pull it apart okay and then there's two screws we're going to take out and the magnets underneath and we're going to replace it. Okay, the last screw is out and remove the sensor, okay? That's the magnet we're going to replace with a one looks similar, but it's a high speed magnet. Okay, in order to get the magnet off, I have to hold the magnet with pliers, otherwise the whole engine will spin. And then break it free um, just be gentle, you, you know, you may want to wrap something around if you're going to reuse the magnet, like a piece of leather or something around it. But uh, since I have a new magnet, I just held it, broke it free, and it's loose now. Now we're going to replace it. Okay, we have the new speed magnet on. This nut came off really hard. It was difficult, and it had red Loctite on it. I don't know if it came from the factory with red Loctite, but the new one comes without it, was able to put it on nice and snug it up too. Okay, so now we're gonna put this hi-hat back on, this sensor, this cap, and then we're gonna give it a test run. Okay, simple. Everything on this, on this uh, golf cart is pretty simple to replace. So next we'll be giving a little test. Okay, I have a bad back, so whenever I do some work I got to put something on the ground and I need like a chair to help me get up and people say oh well, I'll help you work on your whatever it is your lawn tractor your golf cart whatever but you know you want to do things on your own and as long as you're able to you know be safe and careful about it why not you know life's too short to have other people do things for you and you feel useless okay let's see if there's any noticeable difference Oh my goodness, holy cow. <laughs> this is like night and day, it's unbelievable. Who would think that a little magnet would make this thing fly? <laughs> All right, that was pretty fun. I'm glad I did it. <laughs>